Changes when in love, yeah I surround my soul with the positivity That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see, yeah Time to grind, get inside your mind Yeah, we working overtime, that's the only way to climb We gon' make it in our prime, signing on the dotted line Cashing checks left and right, that's the way I'm living life uh, I feel alive when I got a goal in sight Chip away, I gotta fight, ain't nobody else in sight Man, I think I see the light, yeah, that shit is so bright Follow me, I got the guide, see you on the other side, son Ain't nobody know what I'm in Ain't nobody know what I can do I'm ready to go into battle I'll put on a show, razzle dazzle I'm about to take off Never gonna stop till I'm chillin' at the top yeah. Oh, I'm about to take off Never gonna stop till I'm chillin' at the top yeah. Taste of sweat, I won't have any regrets uh, They get upset when they trying just to rest And I'm still right at my desk Make them all feel so pressed, yeah But that's the test, if you wanna be the best It ain't easy, it's a mess If you wanna have success You keep going like possessed Drive it deep into your chest Every failure is a test Learn the most, leave the rest Ain't nobody know what I've been through Ain't nobody know what I can do I'm ready to go into battle I'll put on a show, razzle dazzle I'm about to take off Never gonna stop till I'm chilling at the top, yeah No, I'm about to take off Never gonna stop till I'm chilling at the top, yeah Today was church, um, cleaning. I did do my favorites video. I just need to edit. I did not get to my fall favorite out or my fall outfits because it's just a lot to do. So I will probably do that tomorrow. I'm trying to get this off tomorrow or Tuesday. Um, hold on. 
So what I'm about to do now is just get ready for bed. Um, I guess this is the hairstyle I'm rocking for the week because um, I'm still going to wake up and work out. So um, there's no point in trying to curl it or do anything if I'm going to wake up and work out. Um, I'm going to wash this makeup off my face because I got makeup on for the video. <clears throat> Excuse me. Lots of joy. This is so dangerous to do over your sink. I'm doing that. Okay, so I did not get to do a facial this past Friday or Saturday. So um, I have this new one from my Ipsy bag, the Innisfree Pore Clearing Clay Mask with Super Volcanic Clusters. This is what it looks like. So I'm just going to apply this mask since I just washed my face, see what it's giving. Like, I've been working out and running, but I think sitting in the chair all day today, I'm walking like an old lady. So, I'm about to put this on and go clean up my kitchen. Yeah, if I clean up fast enough, I'm going to go ahead and do a second workout tonight. So... For breakfast um, yesterday I had grapes like a whole bunch a bunch you know a bunch on a stick of grapes for breakfast um, yesterday for lunch I made a little grinder sandwich from my leftover material and today's lunch is gonna be leftover dinner from last night now if you don't understand what I made last night the first dish was sauteed beef with um, not a sesame oil, but it's a it's a Korean sauce, basically to make it taste more orient, um, with gravy, rice, and eggs. That's a dish that South Koreans eat. I've seen it so many times on YouTube, but basically it's the rice with eggs and then the beef and gravy. I left out a key ingredient, which is onions. You're supposed to cut up a whole onion in there to saute with the beef. Completely forgot. But it was still delicious. I didn't eat my bowl completely. Obviously, I don't ever finish what I make. So that is my lunch today. And um, I just cooked up the last of the egg rolls to go with that dish. And then the other dish was a chicken alfredo with um, broccoli and artichokes. I mixed that because literally my broccoli and artichokes in the freezer were just like a handful left. So I just mixed that up with the alfredo sauce and then... Um, 
let that simmer and then um, cooked the last or one of our chicken so the kids can have a choice between beef or chicken tonight or last night so um, that will be my dinner when I come home and with that <clears throat> I'm trying to orchestrate every meal at least have two to three vegetables instead of just one so I'm trying to push I, I'm not trying I am pushing more fruit and veggies on my kids my daughter's happy about it on that cake my son's still kind of fighting me on it but most boys do but um yeah we're just going to continue to grow more towards the fruits and veggies of life and cut back on the breads and sugars and um they're still present but they're just lean with it lean with it okay so i am about to go take my shower i woke up this morning i did wake work out yesterday and this morning, I did not work out again last night. By the time I finished eating, I just kind of sat in the kit or in my bedroom with my daughter and we were talking and chopping it up about school. Um, but I did want to work out. Like my body is like, let's go. I still feel it, but my body doesn't hurt that bad anymore. Um, it's not as sore. Still, it's still. I think I hurt my hip. I don't know. I'm having hip problems. You see, no. Good Lord, Jesus. But yeah, um, I'm about to go relax for like ten minutes and then get in the shower and get my Tuesday work day on the way. This is the look for the day. This is the hairstyle. I can't keep throwing it back when I'm being lazy. I I have the tendency to change my hair every two or three days only because I don't know I've been doing that since I was in junior high like I can't stand to ha unless it's like braids I can't even then I'm switching it up but I don't like going two or three days with the same hairstyle so I had to switch it up just twisted this down laid that down curled the back a little bit um and I decided to have orange on my eyelids for some reason so I put a pop of color on um I'm just in an orange mood right now I think that's probably gonna be my next set of nails also it's orange I'm feeling orange right now. it's fall that's why and I just pick and choose what color I'm feeling for the week right now I'm feeling orange so orange is on my eyes and I'm about to make my matcha and go to work this morning so I didn't have my breakfast killed my lunch though on my break now just sitting at the park it's a little hot today but it's not too bad um, that looks really deep for some reason I think it's the position okay it's a little bit better whatever it just looks really deep right here um yeah I just finished reading my little devotional um, booklet for today's reading um, the second class was more of a course class and see how it's going to go. We have material that we write into as we read the chapter. Chapters are kind of long, so I actually need to start on that tonight or tomorrow. It's the other book. Anyway, it's great so far. Um, yeah. Can you really see that's orange on my eyelids? look orange when you get that close it looks orange from afar just I don't know anyway 
nothing going down on a Tuesday, I guess I'll catch you later. I'm about to take a nap. Got home and I got, I think I showed this last vlog, but these are the um, dry towels and then my new dish towels has come in. Got them um, gray, black, and white. So I'm just gonna kind of clean out my doors here with my old towels and put in the new towels. Good evening, it is Wednesday night. I came home and put on my gym clothes and went straight to the park. Um, I've been wanting to run all day today. Um, it's peaceful and it's not even that I'm stressed out and feel like, oh, I'm overwhelmed, I need to run. It's just, it does give me a lot more clarity and right now I don't have clarity in a lot of situations and a lot of things going on so it just felt really good to go out there and run um the weather's definitely changing it's a little cold right now but um i threw on my sweats went to go run i came back showered freshened up my face uh, moisturized so i smell beautiful and now i'm sitting here i just ate um my dinner which was leftover tacos that I didn't get to eat yesterday that I made. And hmm, today was pretty good for a Wednesday. Um, work was not too hectic, but it's, you know, still has its moments. I am so excited for this Friday coming up. I am going to a spa with my mom and my sisters and it's like a full body spa and I can have the option of getting a facial added on or a pedicure. I haven't decided what I want to do yet because my face, you know, I can take care of my face, but my feet, I'm gonna think, I think I'm gonna let them take care of that because I can't really bend over and, you know, hold my feet like that anymore. Anyway, so nails are breaking off. Oh, yeah, I'm holding the light right now. The nails are breaking off. <coughs> excuse me and um the plan with that is i have to do my hair and my nails sunday because saturday i work so friday i'm off enjoying the spa friday night is a cowgirl birthday party the girl that does my hair has a birthday party and then um saturday i work and then sunday I'll be home doing my hair and my nails. Once again, these weeks are kind of flying by. I feel like I just did my hair and nails. I really feel like I just did them, but I don't know if it's good that the weeks are flying by. I, I, I don't, whatever. Anyway, so a happy hump day and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Y'all, when I say I smell good, I smell good. Okay, so that Ocean by Armani, I got it towards like July, I think, as a summer fragrance, which is good because it's, it's it, I don't know if it reminds you of the Ocean, but it's called Ocean, it's blue, and you know, it smells wonderful, but you know, a smell smells different when it's actually on your body, so the way it smelled on me during the summertime was great refreshing like a cool mist that hits your face on a hot day like it was great but on a cold day now that the season is trying to transition and it's actually windy and cold out right now the smell on my body when it's cold i don't even know if i'm making sense it smells different it's hella different so yeah like i was saying um I just noticed that because the weather is different, I don't know if it's because my body is taking on the temperature different, whatever the case may be, but the smell of Ocean Armani on me in the cooler season, hands down, it's, it's still refreshing, but it's not misty. It's more of a, just a cooler undertone. You guys remember that like cool water when it came out, everybody was like, ooh, cool water. It reminds me of that kind of, I don't know. But it doesn't smell like cold water at all. It's just, 
anyway good morning it's thursday um today this morning so far was rough but i'm still happy and good i'm not like stressed out or anything um it's just my son does things in the household that just disrupts things and my daughter rubs it in so it doesn't help and then i am very anal about my property when i say my property i mean things in my room my charging cord my nail polish and when they tell me to when they when they use my things i tell them over and over put it back i remember growing up in my house my dad was very strict about putting shit back if you use it he doesn't mind that you use it i'm the same way i don't mind that you want to use my nail clipper i don't mind that you want to use my good pair of scissors put it back the way you found it so when i come and look for it it's right there you know what i'm saying but my children they want to see the vein pop in my head because and my daughter is getting better but my son i don't know i think he just he just doesn't pay attention to what his hands are doing and he just does things and thinks it's okay because he's used to things being replaced and it's like look you won't have to get a job okay because <laughs> tired of replacing 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 with this little people in my life don't take care of so i have a lock on my room i told them i'm gonna start locking my door again because they used to have access then i got a lock on my door and then they didn't want to share the bathroom because they both run into the bathroom after school so i unlocked my door i'm gonna start locking my door again because y'all don't clean up after yourself after you use my bathroom y'all don't put stuff back i'm just venting but that was my morning so far. Sorry, this thing keeps dropping. Anyway, so it's Thursday. Um, whew. I don't know if I shared. One of the reasons I ran yesterday is because yesterday was National Pepperoni Pizza Day. And of course, my job ordered pepperoni pizza. And of course, I had about three or four pieces. <laughs> So yeah, I got off of work and I went to the park and ran because that was way off the diet that I was on this whole time. You know what I'm saying? So that's okay though. <laughs> uh, oh, today is my Friday. Tomorrow I am going down below for all day spa with my family. I'm so excited. It's so needed. I don't even like I am excited to see my family don't get it twisted I just I'm just really looking for a spa because I was looking for a spa up here um, to go to and I saw one just never called never made plans or whatever but now we're going as a family to this one I'm so excited I am so excited much needed much needed and then like I said after that I got to drive back home because then my hairstylist birthday party cowgirl theme that sounds like fun and yeah this is just me think out thinking the plans but overall to keep it real um i have been doing my two minute with god um exercises even without the devotional book it's a good habit that's happening because i find myself wanting to go take my midday break to go to have my two minutes with god i'm not even keeping track of the two minutes i'm just going into it and focusing on jesus silence and still like it does give me and i've experienced this before in my life but it does give me a sense of peace overall like this has been honestly <clears throat> the most peaceful feeling week events going on like my kids and stuff of course that's not peace but you know like the feeling inside the way my inside is feeling how i'm thinking is peaceful and it's so true jesus will give me that peace that is not it's not it's not explainable for the human mind i'm not saying the verse right but those i know know what i'm talking about he gives you peace that the human that the world cannot understand that's what it is so i love feeling that because things are happening that i should be like pulling my hair out and stressed out about it's like no i'm actually really good and i have no worries and these people can't drive i'm sorry I am sorry. <sighs> it's a straight shot to my job on this one street, <clears throat> this one avenue. And you're going to have an accident. Oh, my God. 
Oh, he just cut you off, baby girl. This is what happens. And you're just going to pull out here, aren't you? Go, go, go. You're all up in my way anyway. Goddamn. They're just, I passed by six schools on my way to my job. I can take other routes, but they're just as traffic. One route leads to the freeway, which everyone that commutes goes to. So that way is traffic. One way is the main boulevard for our city. So that one's traffic full with big ass trucks, uh, 18 wheeler trucks and shit. So I have this avenue, which has six schools. So either way that I go, I'm hitting shit. But anyway, all the key people are trying, oh, her hair is pretty. Go on, girl. Better cover up that belly. Anyway, these teenagers, yo. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm always in the school traffic, and these parents don't know how to drive. They just, it's not all of them. Most of them are following the rules like me, but some of them are illegally parking, busting a U, cutting. They just doing whatever. They drop the fucking kid off. It's like, it's not that hard. You can actually go across the street and let them walk. Like, that's what I would do. Y'all gonna walk. Go go to the cross the guard. See, cross the guard. Go to the cross the guard. <laughs> I'm feeling good this morning. I hope you guys are too. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Oh, sweet Jesus. Jesus. I call on your name, oh Jesus. Boy, pull your pants up. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna go have a lovely day at work. Um, no makeup, really. Oh, it's so exciting now. No makeup today, really. Just filled in my eyebrows and concealer, little gloss. Um, my hair is a pimp named Slip Back today. It's just, I got that granilla, gr gorilla snot, sticked it on back, because I can't. Yesterday, hairstyle, I don't even think I recorded it. Horrid, horrid. There's moisture in the air, so my hair is thickening on its own. I'm not even sweating, and my hair is barbed wiring up. And like I said, I'm not trying to put heat. I would have to press it and then curl it every morning just to have a decent hairstyle. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I'm considering getting a perm since I do have a short hairstyle now, but I will feel like I would have to cut off the long sides here because those are already brittle and a perm would just make it even more brittle, even though it'll take care of my scalp. Maybe she could just put it on my scalp. Let me talk to April. Cause I'm like, in all honesty, if I could just put it on my scalp and not the hair, I might be okay. Cause it's just my scalp. Friday morning, I woke up at 5, left the house at 6, headed down here to Long Beach for the spa day. Um, it's been a crazy, hectic morning for me. Just a lot going on. Yesterday, um, I came home and cooked fried chicken, collard greens, and um, black eyed peas and rice so my kids can have some food today when they got out of school. Um, I don't like traffic and for some reason it made me take the 405 which I hate the 405 but I took it anyway because it said it was closer but whatever anyway I'm just very anxious just to get there and get this relaxation going because I had pretty much a very stressful night <sighs> let's just say go ahead and get a front group bro you're already like in front of me here ass let's just say that the piece that I had earlier in the week Satan didn't like at all, of course, because I had some praising, I got some study time in, and of course, he throws a socket wrench to throw me off and make me feel opposite by the end of the week. That's what's happening. He's attacking me because I was on fire. I'm still on fire. I still have the peace of Jesus, you know what I'm saying? So, but I just want to come on and say that I am anxious to come in here. I'm actually going to meditate, hopefully. There's not a lot of conversation. You got over to get right back over you. Anyway, I will catch you guys later. Bye. <laughs>
the steam room and then the regular steam room not crazy about that but the eucalyptus steam room and then you had free access to the showers to the lounges to cool aromatherapy towels man Burke Williams you did that I might be late in the game but Burke Williams yeah you did that I never showed my outfit for the day hair is messed up hair is gone but outfit of the day pink pink gray white All pink and gray today, baby. Good morning, Saturday morning. I'm driving to work. I have a little headache. So I did not go to the cowgirl party last night because by the time I got off that freeway, my stomach was hurting. I had a headache. I still have a headache and just got tired and laid down. That, that was my Friday night. Um, I text April. Like, I'm sorry, but anyway, so I have her gift. I'll just have to give it to her later. Um, but yeah, on my way to work, Starbucks just freaking took like 20 minutes for my order just to tell me that, oh, we don't have this in stock. Why don't you block it on the menu and alert the staff? Hey, we don't fucking have this. So people won't order and have to stand there for 20 minutes you know, waiting on something that's not going to happen. I have to change my order anyway. Like, come on, Starbucks, baristas, get it together. If you know you're out of a product, announce it so everybody freaking knows and block it on the menu board. You know what I'm saying? That's just, like, common sense to me. Sorry. Because <laughs> now it's put me a little crunch time to get to work on time. Normally, they don't take that long. That's ridiculous. But anyway, thanks, Mom, for the Starbucks card. <laughs> anyway, yeah, hopefully this day go by as fast. I have my friend's birthday gift, my other friend, Ajari. I have my other friend's birthday gift in the car that I have to mail out to her today. So I will be doing that on my lunch break. I'm going to UPS. Yeah, that's my morning so far. I probably have a headache because of this, but I had a headache coming home from the traffic. Anyway, it's holding my hair down. Tonight, I was supposed to take my son out because my daughter went to the fair last night with her friends and he kind of just was home with me. Um, but we're gonna do that tomorrow because he just likes to do certain things differently than his sister, so I have to respect that. Um, but I have grocery shopping to do today and then I need to um, do my hair tonight because tomorrow is just I need to get refreshed for the week you already know it hair nails well continue my hair maybe nails clothes laundry just all that goodiness to get ready for the week so um, yeah, that's my Saturday, and I will talk to you guys later. By the way, yesterday I got a pumpkin spiced iced la chai latte. That was good. Um, no, 
love pump, the pumpkin spice. I didn't taste a lot of pumpkin spice, but I taste hints of it. Today, I tried to, what I didn't have in stock was brown sugar. And today, I tried to get the apple crisp oat milk shaken espresso. So, they started it and then realized they didn't have the ingredients. So, he was like, what do you want to do? I was like, keep it the same, but add whatever you need to to make it pumpkin. And if there's no, you know, if you're adding oat milk, that's fine, or almond milk. He's like, gotcha. So this is a mixture of that that apple crisp drink, but with a pumpkin spice taste. It's not bad. It's not bad. Hi. Saturday night. After work. Went on and spent some time with the kids. Um, then went grocery shopping, um, came home, put all that away, started our laundry, and um, relaxed a little bit, watched the show. And now I'm about to wash my hair because tomorrow it's already just going to be busy. If I add hair on tomorrow, it's just too much. So I'm going to make myself do my hair tonight. Um, at least to the point of blow drying it. Because um, when I blow dry it, then I can just easily style it on Monday morning so it can look as fresh as possible. So not much of a process. But um, yeah, after that, I think I'm going to go ahead and give myself a facial. It's time to shave a little bit. I might exfoliate because I have blemishes that just keep coming up here. It's annoying. Very annoying. But let me go ahead. I think it's about, what, 9 o'clock? What time is it? Yeah, it's 9 o'clock. So I'm going to go ahead and get started on my hair. I should be done probably by like 10.30 at least. And um, yeah, I'm just going to wrap up this vlog. I look hot mess but Sunday next Sunday next week's vlog I'm gonna look all right watch um yeah so <laughs> uh I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this vlog I'm sorry I'm tired that's why I'm talking so and I will see you guys next week <laughs>